Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today is July 3rd, 2024. I want to discuss something very important. The premise of my channel. The premise of my channel is to maintain a body of someone half my age as the years go on. This has never been tried before. Okay, You think this is easy? It's extremely difficult. By the age of 75, it is a proven scientific fact that around the age of 75, whew, we all take a nosedive in our physical capability. That's the magic number, 75. Fat-free mass rises up, so i.e. lean mass kind of rises pretty significantly from birth till about the age of 25. And then it slowly starts to go down. By the way, this is true for males and females. From age 25 to 75, there is indeed a gradual reduction of lean mass. But then something happens at the age of 75, which is the fall off in lean mass becomes much more significant. It's, and then 75 and on where you fall off a cliff. Okay. I'm still young at 60. However, I'm, I'm going to counteract that. And the only way to do that, you need to exercise for life. You ever hear use it or lose it? It has to be for life. Not, I work out six months, I take a month off. This is what happens to all the people when they take a month off, two months off. That's when the aging accelerates. Okay. It has never been done before. All these people talking about studies, exercise, <clears throat> prove, doesn't prove that you live longer. No, 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 no. You're wrong, scientists, you're wrong, because who exercised a lifetime? Who? Who did you study that exercised their entire life? First of all, when people reach older age, they lose the capability to continue to exercise like a young person. After that, it's like a chain reaction, downhill. If someone can maintain the capability to exercise like a youthful person, even in older age, it will be different results. Your studies are flawed. Your studies do not apply to me. And I mean no disrespect to anyone here. Okay. I don't follow these studies, but they're not accurate. Everybody believes this. Another thing I want to talk about, there are two things, ladies and gentlemen, that only exercise can help with that is involved with accel accelerated aging. I mentioned this before on my channel, motor units. There is no supplement, there is no diet, there is nothing in this world, there is no medication that can slow down the loss of motor units except for exercise. Motor units accelerate aging when you get older. People, scientists are not telling you this. They're telling you that they're trying to uh, find uh, something that, that uh, reverses aging or slows aging. You can't. Unless you slow the loss of motor units, you're not doing anything. I don't care what you do. I don't care what you try to stop. If you do not slow the loss of motor units, you are going to age like a regular person. No matter how good you eat, no matter what supplements you take. Another thing I want to talk about is gravity. Gravity. Only exercise. Gravity accelerates aging. Gravity has everything to do with aging. Only exercise can fight gravity. For example, when astronauts go in space in microgravity, what do you think they, they, they do? They have to exercise because their VO2 max, I, I forget the numbers, like 25% in a week, it drops. They lose muscle tissue like this fast. That's why they, they exercise. Okay. Exercise, movement. We were born to move. Our body was made for movement. Our limbs, our muscles... Our brain, our brain tells our muscles to move. This was for survival. Evolutionary. We are made to move. We are made to eat. When we wake up in the morning, we move. We don't eat. Everything revolves around movement. Exercise. Exercise is the father. Everything else is the baby. Good sleep, quality lifestyle, social connections, nutrition, supplements, diet. They all are made to make you better for movement. Gravity tears you down. 
If you don't work out your muscles, that's what makes you shriveled up in all the rage. Gravity. You need the only way to fight gravity is to exercise. Supplements ain't going to help there. Go ahead, research it. Diet, the special diet, these longevity biohackers, they take cold showers. And I mean, no disrespect, you do what you want to do. Exercise must be a priority for life. For life, ladies and gentlemen. I'll give you an example. I mentioned this before in other videos. These biohackers, they want to live to 150. First of all, no one is living to 150. Not today. You, you could do whatever you want. You could try whatever you want. 120, maybe a good possibility. Maybe a good possibility. So here's my question to you, ladies and gentlemen. You eat good. You do all everything perfect. You do everything perfect. You're a healthy 90-year-old. Tell me about your body, your muscles, your bone density. Food can't help there. Supplements can't help there. You need to work out. You need to work out. So when you reach 90 and you have the body of a 90-year-old, what makes you think you're going to go to 120 with a body of a 90-year-old? Do you see what 90-year-olds look like? Again, no disrespect to anyone. I'm just stating facts here. I don't care. The best 90-year-old athletes... Do you see what they, how they move? Do you see how they run? They run like 90-year-olds. They are frail. Every one of them. Every one of them. Centenarians, every one of them is frail. Every one of them. There is no such thing as a not frail centenarian. A, a centenarian cannot jump on a box and jump back down. He will break his legs. So, and, and another thing I want to say, there is no such thing as healthy aging in today's world. There's no such thing. It's a healthy aging. Healthy aging, people suffer from diseases. All centenaries take medication for diseases. All of them. Every single one of them. You don't, Not even centenarians. People 65 and over are all on some kind of medication for age-related disease. So if all this stuff about nutrition and supplements is the go-to, how come people are all suffering from pain, joint pain? They can't work out. They can't sleep. You name it. And they eat good. They work out all their life. Go ahead. All you biohackers that are into, oh my God, my skin. What is this? What is that going to do for you that you have less wrinkles when you're 90 years old? You think that's going to make you not frail? You could have perfect health, ladies and gentlemen. When you reach that 75 mark, you need to keep the body youthful. Everything else, no, you don't stop, Not you, you continue all the nutrition, you do all that. But all that supports the, what we were born to do, is that's to move. That's what the premise of my channel is. And it's not an easy thing for me to do. It's not an easy thing for me to do. It's very difficult what I'm doing. And I am going to do it. I am going to do it. No one has ever tried this. No one showed me. A 75, 80, 90 year old, they moved like someone much younger, much, much younger. Like half their age. There is none. There is none. Because everybody does the same thing over and over. So why am I gonna do the same thing over and over? Huh? Why am I gonna why am I gonna do the same thing other people do and, and end up like them? No. I'm gonna change this. I'm gonna change this. And and I, so far, so far, I'm proving it. I'm not look at my videos. I'm not taking steroids. I'm not taking none of that, ladies and gentlemen. I am I am a 100% natural. Natural, baby. That's the only way you can go a long ways if you're natural. When you put drugs... And another thing I want to say, this biological age stuff. Some of these guys suffer, already have a disease. And again, no disrespect. No disrespect. How are you going to stand here and tell me you have a younger biological age, 20 years younger, and you suffer from a disease? It doesn't matter if you're on medication. You don't have a younger biological age. If you did, if you were more youthful, you wouldn't have a disease. Perfect health is disease-free. Again, no disrespect. No, no, no. I don't mean to offend anyone. I'm just stating logic and common sense here. Once your body has a disease, I don't care what you do, ladies and gentlemen. It doesn't matter. 
You cannot possibly have a younger a person, a younger biological age. You can't. How? You have a disease. Your body is not normal any longer. Anyway, I, I, I don't want to rant on. The point I'm trying to say is you need to maintain the capacity to train like a youthful person. Because once you lose that capacity, everything is downhill. Everything. I don't care what you eat. I don't care what you do. You need to slow down the loss of motor units. I'm making a video. It's coming to explain everything. I don't know why scientists are omitting this from the public. It's not fair. It's not fair. You, they want to they sell you supplements that promote longevity. It doesn't. You're going to end up like a regular person. You're going to end up, when you reach 75, if you didn't train to slow down those motor units and to fight gravity, you're going to suffer from diseases like the average person that never worked out. And I'm not kidding you. Have a great day, ladies and gentlemen. See you again in my next video.